Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. I was just thinking about the old days. Come with me, if you will, on a journey back in time. It's 2003, and I've just joined this networking site called Friendster. It's great, because you can take your friends from real life... Hello. ..and put them on the internet. No, thank you. Then you can meet their other friends on the internet, and they can meet your other friends on the internet. It's mind-blowing! Oh my God, we're creating a whole new way of relating to people. No, by criminal, it's a whole new world where you don't have to mix with twats anymore. Because, you know, all the people you know will come pre-approved by people you already know and like. Oh, you know, all the twats can get together and drink cider and listen to techno. Whilst we, the nice people, will be able to skip through fields together in a world of joyous internet harmony. Now it's 2007 and I've got 571 friends on MySpace. Meh. Yep, yeah, let's face it, they're not really my friends. I've met some of them in real life and they're absolute tossers. Some of them have pictures of their cats on their profiles. Several of them enjoy the music of Shania Twain. Four of them under hobbies list chillaxing. And I know some of you are sitting there smugly saying, oh, she's only got 571 MySpace friends. I've got 862. I have 863. Yeah, well, good for you. They're not really your friends. It's just a collection. You may as well collect porcelain frogs like that woman who smelled of egg and lived on the caravan site with Auntie Peggy. Surely by now everybody's heard about Dunbar's number, you know, where the anthropologist Robin Dunbar theorised that there's a cognitive limit on the number of people with whom any individual can maintain stable interpersonal relationships. Essentially what he's saying is that your tiny brain is so limited that you can only actually cope with having 150 friends. So start culling now and start with me, please. So I was on Friendster and then I went to MySpace and now everybody keeps saying, oh, come and join me on Facebook. But, you know, you know you have to make new friends. It's like changing high schools. Do you know anybody who changed high schools a lot who isn't completely fucked up? No, you don't. Internet popularity isn't real popularity. I mean, sure, you know, we could try and get more hits for this show by cynically exploiting people's weaknesses, by, I don't know, featuring scantily clad young women or something like that. But, oh, hang on. Sorry? It's me! Oh god, MySpace. Yeah! How are you? Sorry, look, this is actually this is my space, not my space. This yeah. is actually where I live. I know, it's my but space. I just thought we could, you know, chill out. Yeah, this no. Is some Shania. No, that's a terrible idea. I'm, you're not actually my friend. No, but this we are. Problem. We are because you accepted my friend request. Yes, I did. Yeah. And that was basically just to make myself look but more I am popular. your friend because you accepted my friend request? No, no, so that, that doesn't friend. actually Those make us actual friends. friends. Yeah, no, but that's. You approved that video I had of the cat when we were on the dance hat. Yes, it was shit. I want you to get out. We could be great friends. No, no, I just. Get no, out. Shoot. Shoot. Oh. come on out, out, out. No, but I just, I just want to be your friend. Just, None oh, of my friends are talking oh, anymore. Oh, girls cry. Oh, I'll come in then. Wow, great flat. Is that a character? Yeah, well done. Look, I might as well introduce you to everybody. Um, this is John. This is Duncan. This is the bear. Hi, Liz. How have you been? Oh, God, don't tell me he's one of your MySpace friends as well. <laughs> no. We used to fuck. Ooh. Sorry, do I know you? No. It's me. Still no. Oh, it's okay. She's one of my MySpace friends. Hi. Have you got any wine? No. She does. And in park. It's big, it's strong, it's black currency, and it'll get you absolutely trolleyed. It tastes like God's piss. Oh, can you not say that, please? Jesus piss? No. Have you tasted this? Lucy Loves You is momentarily sponsored by Camden Park, available in all good wine shops. I feel